to the 222nd Army Battalion, to B Company, where they rake together all the leftovers and troublemakers deemed expendable by the Army. They call it Bad Company, a mismatched bunch of rejects placed to serve our country as cannon fodder. My name is Preston Marlowe. They could have thrown me in jail for what I did, but instead, they transferred me here. This is my story. Private Preston Marlowe reporting for duty, sir. You sure you're in the right place? I believe so, sir. This is B Company, right? Yep, sure is. But you want to cut out that sir, yes sir crap? I'm a sergeant, not the goddamn president. Okay, sorry sir. I mean, sergeant. Yeah, whatever. That one over there, his name is Sweetwater. Hey, welcome to the sandbox. His name is Hacker. Hey, how you doing? You smell very clean. My name's Redford, you can call me that, or Sarge. We're all in this mess together now. Right, Sarge. Do you know what squad I'm supposed to belong to? A new guy trying to smell, like a brand new toy. Yeah, I'll give you three to two, he's dead by Friday. Sarge? You can ride with us. New guy. New guy? Okay. Let's get to know the others. Haggard over here, he's a natural born demolition expert. What? I just like it when stuff blows up. Yeah, and that's just fine as long as it's the enemy stuff. Yeah, that's sweet water. But if you ever need somebody to talk a hole in your head. That's a cheap shot. I don't really talk that much. Bravo one, Charlie. This is Mike One Juliet. Over. Oh, listen, it's the new dispatch girl, Miss Tulane. Mike One Juliet, this is Bravo One Charlie. Over. You ought to move up ahead of the convoy to scout the terrain. I'll get back to you with further orders. Out. Oh, she's got a real nice voice. Sweet one. Check it out. It's Calvary. Yeah, isn't it amazing how we always go towards the fighting and they're always flying in the opposite? I hope those are our guns. It's a beautiful sound either way. It's an ammo! Ah, typical! Quit your wine and sweet! It's about time we got some action! Look at the new guy! He's... Oh, look! The new guy's dead! Already? Already? I was just about to learn his name. I think it was probably Joe. He usually is. His name is Preston. Preston Marlowe. And he's not dead. Right, soldier? Let's see if you're okay. Try following my instructions. Look up. Okay, now look down. You feel okay, Marlo? Hey, new guy, get your ass over here. Crouch under the car. There you are, new guy. Oh, you sure don't smell so good anymore. <laughs> well, welcome to bad company. Damn, you're a mess. You sure you're still alive? Use the auto injector. It's good stuff. Gets you back on your feet. That's what I'm talking about. Good as new. Looks like your weapon took a beating as well. Let's find out if it works okay. Try hitting those barrels over there. be working fine. Make sure you pick up any extra ammo you find in crates or on fallen enemies. We can use all we can get our hands on. You know, you can shoot grenades too. Try blowing a hole in that house. It's fun. No need using the door. Just make your own. This vehicle's busted. Marlo, grab a power tool. See if you can fix it. That's the power tool you've got there. 
Hold on to it. You can use it to fix any broken vehicles. Marlo, get this piece of junk on the road. Good job, Marlo. Maybe we'll keep you around after all. Yeah. Thanks for pimping my ride. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet, over. Uh, the dulcet tones of Miss July. Mike One Juliet, this is Bravo One Charlie, over. We're getting some heavy shelling from grid 641. You've got to go ahead to take out the artillery base. Out. You heard the lady. We're taking the artillery base. That's not playing it very safe. My middle name is not safe. Well, actually, it's uh, Gordon, but... Uh... Now let's move out before those Russians get their act together. So what are we gonna do, Sarge? We just gonna run straight through the enemy lines? Yeah, Haggett, that's a great idea. Or we could use the vehicle over there. So, the field manual's kinda hazy on four-man assaults on heavy artillery positions, but I was thinking maybe, uh... Now let's just get up there and kill them to teeny tiny pieces. No, listen. We're not taking any chances. We go in as a team and we stay in cover as far as possible. Now move out. This is our stop. Eyes open, okay? And Sweetwater, just shut up. What? I didn't say anything. What you just did. That's not fair. Here we are, but what am Shut I? Shut up! Stay low. Multiple hostiles up ahead. Enemy coming! Take it! 
fine too. Way to go, new guy. Staying alive. Very good start. Regroup! Bravo one, Charlie. Are the artillery guns still intact? Juno convoy hit some trouble down by the bridge. Over. Mike one, Juliet. You want us to use the enemy guns? Over. Affirmative. Bracket the hostiles by the bridge, boys, but be advised. We've got friendlies in the area. Out. I ain't gonna do it. If I hit our guys, y'all gonna yell at me. Hey, crazy idea part two. Let the new guy do it. Good one. Marlo, stay sharp. Convoy, seeing those enemy vehicles inbound. Start hitting those targets ASAP. Okay, we're on it, Mike One Juliet. Out. Oh. I could sure use a break from all this walking. Why don't we try to find some ride? Oh yeah! We could get one of those monster trucks. Like uh Truckosaurus Rex. I'll bet that surprised the hell out of those Russians. I really don't know how to respond to that, Haggard. Initiative, new guy. This is perfect. Well, it ain't Truckosaurus Rex.
Alright, area is clear. Thanks. Secure and hold that crossing and we'll join you as soon as we have cleared a path. Out. Did we check out the house? Negative. Could be something valuable inside, though. Yeah, looting is an old wartime tradition, Sarge. Marlo, you take a look. You're letting the new guy do it? That's not fair. Hey, new guy, where'd you get that gun? It looks uh, slightly less crappy than the one you had before. Enemy helicopter! Oh man, oh man, oh man, please don't let him have seen us. Mike 1 Juliet, this is Bravo 1 Charlie, over. Bravo 1 Charlie, this is Mike 1 Juliet. Great work at the River Passage, boys. I've got a new job for you straight away. You are go for Objective Mustang. Over. Could you tell her I said hi? Objective Mustang, affirmative, out. Okay, listen up, boys. There's a farm due west, possibly held by Russian forces. We're going to scout it and clear out any hostile.
So new guy, I bet you're wondering how three nice guys like us ended up in bad company, right? <laughs> I bet he won't be wondering for long. Well, Haggard got transferred here for blowing up the biggest ammo dump east of Paris. I myself accidentally uploaded a virus to the Army Secure Network, and Sarge... Well, why don't you tell him yourself, Sarge? I made a deal. They cut my term short if I agreed to transfer here. Only problem is, B Company has the highest mortality rate in the Army. So the Sarge is really playing long odds. For three more days, then I'm going fishing and you can have this war all to yourself. So we'll pretty much be playing it safe from here on. This should be hard, dude! Shit! Fine, come on! Radio! Die already, you stubborn bastard! Oh. 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 Get me right now! Didn't we just shoot these guys?
Do you hear that? I thought I heard something. Is this another joke about me talking too much? Because if it is, I can tell you that... He's right. It's coming from the barn. Oh, crap! Big brother! Got to take out that tank! Arno! We need something else to take down that tank. See what you can find. Group after smoke. Feels good, doesn't it? I remember blowing up my first tank. Mm, mm, mm. Bravo one, Charlie. This is Mike one, Juliet. You've got air support inbound. Stay low and wait for the bird. Out. Bravo 1, Charlie. This is Super 65. I'm inbound to your AO. Hang tight. Out. Got a visual on the LZ. Stand clear. Out. Here's the 65. I'm here. I'm here. Oh, hell. Make it to the top. Having trouble getting an evac chopper to your position, so you're going to have to keep working for a while. What's your status? Over. We're good to go. Over. We are rerouting your squad to deal with the anti-air battery at Objective Impala. This is your new objective. Out. Listen, guys. Objective Impala is an anti-air enforcement. Our orders are to take it out. Gear up. I wonder what Miss July would like to do for a weekend getaway. You wouldn't have the guts to ask her. This is a war, Sweetwater. You don't get the weekend off. Yeah, well, someday this war's gonna end. Wash your mouth out with soap. Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. We're seeing a lot of enemy movement in your area. Machine gun in the tree Over. line! Affirmative. Supply trucks and support. Over. I hear you. I'm tight for a while. Oh. Look around for C4! Down in! Oh, <laughs> 
Okay, take it easy with the explosives. Don't get me wrong, you can have some great fun with them. Just be careful where you place them. Use the C4 and blow up those guns now! Marlo, get to it! Marlo, you still got that C4? Oh, Blow that so last great. gun! I can't believe I made it! Teamwork, guys. Regroup! Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Over. This is Bravo One Charlie Actual. Over. Great work on those AA guns. Not quite time to kick back yet, though. The trucks you spotted seem to be headed for a farm to the east. It may be a supply dump, and if you're still in the fight, you're our best shot to take it out. Over. Yeah, yeah, we've got it. Over. Then you are go for Objective Bronco. Out. Okay, guys. It seems we've got another farm to secure before I can leave for that fishing trip. Buckle up. Hey, Preston. You wouldn't have a couple of bucks to borrow me. Don't give him any. He's always trying to borrow from rookies. Yeah, because you die so fast that most of the time I don't have to pay back. No offense. No, why should he be offended? Heavens to Betsy. You're just trying to steal his money while you wait for him to die. I figure if I hit a hundred rookies for ten bucks, that's uh, ten thousand dollars to the Haggard Retirement Fund. Yeah, or you could use it to brush up on your math. Yeah, when you're rich, you don't need that. Russians are on the move!
We've got enemy reinforcements coming in. Are we gonna do this whole offensive by ourselves? I mean, weren't there one or two other guys here a while ago? You know, the U.S. Army? Oh, uh, they're on their way, but we're gonna have to hold this place until they get here. Demolition experts, look out for RPG. We've got a vehicle moving by the bridge. Coming by the bridge! It win a fight. One of those uh, Russian tanks or the Truckosaurus Rex? Well, the tank, sure, it has firepower, obviously. But those jaws on the Truckosaurus Rex, man, I've seen them chew through solid steel.
one, Charlie. Objective Taurus is a go. Stand clear of kill box and wait for the fireworks. This is 07 at 12 miles now, bearing 270 Angel Street. Oh, man! I should have joined the Air Force! That's what I call an explosion! Bravo 1, Charlie. Hope you enjoyed the show. Juno Convoy is rolling again. Good job, boys. Now move in and clear out remaining hostiles. Out. Are those guys really Ruskies? I don't think so, Hags. Man, I have a bad feeling about this. Level 1 Charlie Actual, reporting success on Objective Taurus. Over. You've done great, Sergeant. And you're all still there? Over. Actually, I think we've lost Sweetwater. Come again? Over. Dismiss that. Out. Sweetwater! Oh, sorry, Sergeant. I'm over here, Sarge! And I think you'd all better get in here. Boy, this better be good. You haven't gone and hurt yourself, have you? If they ship you home as well, I'll be alone with the new guy. Uh, <laughs> come here, take a look at this. He's not Russian? Nope, we got ourselves a mercenary. One of the Legionnaires, no less. Whoa, the Legionnaire? I thought that was just a spook story. Nah, he's real. Got his own damn army. Some say the deadliest in the world. Now look at this. Acta non verba. That's the Legionnaire's motto. It's Latin, and it means action, not words. Hang on, I was at the Taco Emporium. I think you'll find that Spanish. Oh, just shut up. Then your motto should be verba non acta, because you never shut the hell up. Let's get out of here. Uh, you, you should listen, Sarge. Knowledge is power. For example, rumor says he always pays in gold bars. 
I'll just check uh, for a pulse in his pockets. Well, slap me hard and call me El Dorado. Okay, El Dorado, let's have a look. Whoa, whoa, finders, keepers, oh, no, 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 So, that's how it started. We found this little piece of gold. To people with less moral fiber, that might have posed a problem. But we're all men of duty. So, when the sergeant said the gold belonged to the army, we all agreed and got back to work. With Uncle Sam being so busy with the war and all, and the gold bar being so small, we thought it was best if we held on to it for him, splitting it four ways. Not that everybody was happy with that arrangement. Well, maybe it won't buy you a whole truck, but you can start with the hubcaps and build from there. Shut your trap, Sweetwater. Whoa, we're going to Zabagrad, huh? Nice place? It's 20 clicks behind enemy line. Important harbor. The army's launching on offensive, and we're going to be the first ones to go in. Haven't they got guys specially trained for that? Well, we're going in before them. They're too expensive to waste. Yeah, that makes sense. Weren't you supposed to be shipping home about now, Sarge? Tomorrow, Haggard. One more day of this shit, and the only thing I'm going to be fighting a blue mark. Yeah, I hear you, Sarge. Next up, the Caribbean. Well, after Zabograd. Zabograd a ding dong. I'm out of here, boy. Good hunting. Hey, sweets. Ain't this the same fancy thing that was on that dead guy? Acting on verba. Yep, sure is. Let's check it out. Could be a trap. Hey, new guy, you check it out. Let's move out. We've got some Russian movement over there. They haven't seen us. And if they do, it doesn't really matter, because we're easily replaced and we won't be missed. Is that it? There's got to be more somewhere else.
Regroup! Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Over. This is Bravo One Charlie Actual. Over. You are go for objective backfield. Out. Okay, listen up guys. Our armored division is moving in, and our job is to cut off Russian supply lines before they get here. Let's get ready. This is the plan. We hit the weapons depot first. Once we have that area secured, we regroup and we move on to the fuel dump. Excuse me, Sarge, but wouldn't it be easier to do it the other way around? Or, or we could split up into teams and take them both at the same time. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, that's interesting. Or I could shoot the two of you and do this thing along with Marlo. Uh, okay, we'll do it your way. You're the boss.
Well done! Weapons depot destroyed! I'll need your... We have enemies inbound! I can hear it! Taken care of. Russians! Guys, regroup. Bravo one, Charlie. This is Mike one, Juliet. We have a Russian advance team approaching the bridge. They're your priority target. You cannot let them control the bridge. Over. Mike one Juliet, we spread real thin down here. How about some air support? Over. Bravo one Charlie, negative on support request. I've got nothing for you right now. Can you deal with the situation? Over. Yes, yeah, we can deal. Out. I hate being dependable. Sarge, see that thing over there? I think it's a Russian mortar guidance system. Interesting. Bet we could use it against them. Hell of a bet, Sarge. Hell of a bet.
нет! Сброс! Есть! Бомба пошла! Вот вам! Браво, Уан Чарли! Это Майк Уан Джулиет. У меня есть хорошая новость для вас, ребята. Атака на Забоград начала. Продолжайте до сити лимитов и держите для больших ордеров. Ты слышал ее? Мы двигаемся. Это нормально с меня. Мы выходим сначала? Может, Maybe you'll find some gold. That's not why we're here. You want to sail the Caribbean? You gotta buy a boat, right? One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. The Russians are in better shape than we thought. We need you to take out the defensive positions. That's objective offside for the record. Out. Did she sound a bit upset? I thought she sounded upset. That can't be a good sign. It must have been something you said. I said I, I never talked to her. Listen up. Objective offside is a backup plan. It means our tanks are in trouble. We better get those guns right now and stay in line this time.
Is that a silencer? <laughs> Damn it, 
Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet, over. This is Bravo One Charlie Actual, over. Seems you've saved the day again. Things got a little hectic up here, over. They're pretty hectic down here, too. I can hear you, Sweetwater, but you're doing a fine job, over. Over there! Name. Second Focus, boy. Focus. Your orders are to rendezvous with the armor division at the beachhead. Out. Rendezvous at the beachhead. We're moving out. She knows my name, Haggard. She knows my name. I've been thinking about Miss July. How do you know she's good looking? I have this cousin who has a beautiful voice, but a face like a can of dog food. Is that the one that you dated? Yep. Cool. Well, well, look who decided to show. Better late than never, I guess. Even though we've already pretty much finished the job for them. How come those guys get all the cool toys? They look good in those photos they stage for the press. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Your orders are to join up with the 32nd Armored Division for the final push into Zabograd. Over. Yeah? We were hoping for some R&R &R at this point. Over. That's just gonna have to wait. We're low on troops right now, so command is throwing everything we've got at that town. And that includes your squad. Over. I hear you. Out. or the attack will fail. Stay close to them and keep your eyes open.
Boys, we got them through. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Over. Mike One Juliet, this is Bravo One Charlie. Over. We're gonna keep you out of the main battle for a while. But there's something else I need you to do. Over. I bet there is. Over. I need you to find the Zabograd command post and disable their communications before they call in any reinforcements. You do a good job on this? Maybe I can get your boys out of bad company. Over. If it's getting us out of here, we're all over it. Right, Sarge? Mike One Juliet, we're gonna go take a look. Out. Let's move out.
throwing them. Watch out for those persons. Infantry approach. Close one. Regroup. Bravo one, Charlie. This is Mike one, Juliet. Looks like you were too late, Sergeant. They made the call. More hostiles inbound. Over. We moved as quickly as we could. Over. You're supposed to go home tomorrow, Sergeant. This is no time to start making mistakes. I need you to get your act. What was that? Bravo One Charlie, you've got a new priority order. We have a downed tank in the city square. I need you to find a good defensive position and protect it until our engineers can get it out. You hear me, Sergeant? Over. Roger that. Any further information about what they're throwing at us? Over. No intel on that. I'm sure he'll find out. Out. We're on it. Out. You heard her. We go to the square and we try to get a visual on that tank. There it is! Over by the fountain! Looks dry to me, Sarge! Oh, just let the engineers worry about that. Our job is to defend it till they get here. The end. That building over there looks like a decent defensive position. Oh man, am I glad to see you guys. I got myself into a bit of trouble here. <laughs> you guys don't got any jumper cables on you, do you? Ah, crap. Some more Russians. There's a lot of them. Yeah! And I... We died in hell! Russians. 
Hostiles! Damn! Enter formation! Charlie, this is Mike 1 Juliet. The enemy is evacuating a large weapons cache. Should be a good opportunity for the final push on the harbor. And try not to screw up this time around. Out. Harbor, eh? You think there might be some mercenaries down there? Why, because you think they may have some gold? Yeah. Let's go. by ourselves and... Well, Miss, Miss Yulai did say something about getting you transferred out of the company. The road's out. Looks like we're walking. Let's go up this hill here. We need a better view. Look, 
They're leaving. All of them. We actually did it. You think we're gonna get that transfer? I don't know, but you've deserved it. Yeah, right. Hey, check it out. Down by those trucks. Those are mercs, right? Looks like them. Shouldn't we stop them? You know, uh, ask some questions, maybe search them? Our orders are to secure this area, so I guess... What? No, hang on. Well, what happened to not taking any chances? What about playing it safe? These guys could be dangerous, and you're going home tomorrow, remember? This will only take a minute. to the others now? Nothing. Not even a nugget. Where are they going so fast? You lost them, you imbecile! Now I know what I'm doing. This is a shortcut. You know what you do. You know what you do. If I had a penny for every time you said that, I wouldn't be needing this gold. Didn't we just shoot? Those are the trucks. I told you it was a shortcut. They're crossing the border now. We can't follow them any farther. Where did the hacker go? That's a neutral zone. Hagger, fall back! He can't hear you, Sarge. If he could, he wouldn't listen. I hate to say this, but we have to go and get him back. Do we, do we, do we really have to go and get him back? I mean, have to? Move out. Didn't we just shoot these guys? Oh, 
готовится. Три, два, один. Guys!
So, Haggard had pretty much single-handedly invaded a neutral country. Not the best move. Is this your idea of fun, Haggard? Well, yeah. May I ask you why? The gold! Didn't you see it? I mean, Sweetwater can never swallow a piece that big. Just shut it, Hag. Give me one good reason that I should not send your ass to jail. Well, because you love me, Sarge. In a Plutonic way. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Over. Mike One Juliet, this is Bravo One Charlie. Over. I hope you have a very good explanation for this, Sergeant. Over. It was my call. We had to, you know, retaliate a hostile. You know, a threat. Over. Just get yourself back to base. Over. That's fine with me. I was planning to go fishing anyway. Over. You're facing court martial. I don't think you're gonna go anywhere for at least nine to twelve months. Out. Shit. That was bad, wasn't it? That was bad. It was bad, Hags. It's about as bad as anything we've ever done. Whatever no. you've done, it's as bad as that. Not like Chris Kristofferson's third album. Oh, bad. Worse. Worse. Oh, no way! Let me think, let me think. So, where does this leave us? We're here, ain't we? What? Where'd those trucks go? Oh, no, no, Sarge, you can't be serious! Yes, I am. What? You want to go after the gold? I'll never get any medal from the army, will I? You guys coming or what? I'm, I'm, I'm not sure that this is happening for the right reasons. Gold sweets, 24 carats. What kind of motivation do you need? What do you think, Preston? Hell. I guess I could use a couple million, same as everybody else. Ah, uh, guys, wait up! I think the trucks went up that way. I'm gonna catch up with them. Sarge, Haggard's running away again. Shit, look at that. I know, he runs like a girl. No, I'm talking about something else. I bet we just got broadcasted live to every shooter in this godforsaken country. But if we blow the antennas, Track what you can't see. It'll get the U.S. Army off us too, Sarge. Stay down! This place is crawling with snipers! Move to cover! Goddamn RPG! see us, they can't pick us up. And if they can't pick us up, we can do whatever we want. And that would be trying to steal a truck full of gold from the world's deadliest mercenary. Well, it beats flipping burgers for a living. 
I really hate to admit that that is a of quite impregnable logic. What did you just say? Way to go! Sapper, over there! Seven deadly sins, right? So is Jimmy. Uh, no, actually, you're thinking about the Ten Commandments. Now, the seven deadly sins are greed, avarice, lust, sweet water. Just shut up. Понял! Приготовиться! Три, два, 
Нет! Сброс! Gargantuan trail of destruction we left. Watch my man! Perfect shot! Shit to a mouth, Haggard! calls me Gordon. How about Elizabeth? Elizabeth? Yes. Liz? I will accept Liz. But you better not call me it, or I will be very angry. And you wouldn't want to see me angry. Get out! I see some rocks. 
Сохранись! Бомба пошла! Вот вам! find anything. It's equal shares, right? Those trucks are going. I think there's a harbor that way. You know these things, and I don't. That's really weird. Well, that's why I'm in charge. Yeah, about that. Now that we're AWOL, you're not really a sergeant anymore, are you, Redford? Hmm. Either you do as I say, or I'm gonna have to beat your ass into submission. Yeah, okay. It was just, you know, a technical question, Sarge. Well, don't ask me no technical questions. I'm afraid I see some Russians. One more down! They're all down!
is heavily guarded. Well, we're heavily armed. Are we really going in here? I know the trucks are in there. I just know it. All right, let's have a closer look. They don't pay enough for this kind of stuff. Support troops! Big gun, no bang! Oh, no! 
them out, Pagan. Hey, that's a big boat. Sweet. Tell me about the Legionnaire. Cargo holds loaded with gold, right? Lots and lots of gold. Let's take a look. This place is swarming with mercs. I bet the gold is around here somewhere. Stay low. Tango's all over the place. Take cover! Enemies! Twelve o'clock! Intercept! Stand down! I want to say that. Why? Sounds cool. Really shut him up. You shut up. Look around. That arm. Say goodbye to the gold. So, I wonder what jail's gonna be like. I hear the food's pretty good. Yeah, I got a feeling the food is gonna be the least of my problems. Dropping the soap is what I'm worried about. I hate that. It's all mush in your hands. You can't grab it. Slip you two just shut up.
so we were in a little bit of trouble. But with the army, there's always a hidden agenda. Even though Sadaristan was officially neutral, military intelligence was suspicious and dying to get a closer look. The four of us, already officially AWOL, just happened to fit the bill. Instead of sending us to prison, they gave us an offer that, you know. So explain this one more time. First, they're angry with us for going into Sudaristan, but then they send us back in. They want us to find Zavomir Sadar. Zavomir, sir, did you say? Zavomir Sadar, father of the people, local dictator and all around creep. Officially, he's neutral, but he's been playing both sides in the war for a very long time. Maybe his luck ran out. Anyway, we're here to persuade him to come in with us, all undercover style. So now we can go in and, and no one's gonna mind. Officially, the army's got nothing to do with this. If anyone catches us, we're still AWOL. Now let's find that observation point. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. You back with me, Sergeant? Over. Yeah. We've got a little sidetrack, though. Over. An objective of your own? Over. Yep. Didn't pay off, though. Over. You pull this one off, you can start thinking about that fishing trip again. Over. So I've heard. Out. Is that a golf course? Of course it's a golf course. That's what dictators do. Build things they really don't need while their people starve. Hey, there's our chopper. He's flying really close to those bases, though. Ah, it shouldn't be a problem. Officially, they're on a search and retrieve mission. So Daristan guys won't touch it. I don't know. I have a bad feeling about this. Shit. Oh, shit! Shit! Mike One Juliet, this is Bravo One Charlie. Looks like these guys ain't neutral anymore. Over. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. We know, we know. Now get moving and find Sadar and- Yeah, but how do we get him out without an extraction bird? Over. I was getting to that. There are three enemy SAM sites. You take those out, you'll get your extraction chopper. Eventually. Roger, out. Okay, there's the first one.
John Lennon. I love me some Vodnik. Just shoot these guys! Rocket! This is what I hate about, about the army! Stay sharp, guys. There's a lot of activity down there. I wonder what kind of handicap they have. I bet they're all really good players. I mean, they'd have to be, right? Oh, he's he's down. Down. to go one down hostile on the car spotted right the great soldier Russia Yeah, I'm in the 
ammo. Reloading. Edge technology, boy. Yeah. Cool! Because they kind of look like golf carts, sweat water. Ah, oh, shit. Patrol boat! Bitch, who shot that? Bang, got up! That's right! Yeah, you such a good boy. Thank you. 
on, friend. There's the last one. That's the end of that. Regroup time. Mike One Juliet, this is Bravo One Charlie, over. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet, over. Okay, all three SAM launches are out, but this operation isn't exactly covert anymore, over. You're doing good work, Sergeant. I'm not authorized to give you helicopter support at this time, but I'm dropping off a surprise that's gonna make your lives a little bit easier. Make your way to the drop zone ASAP, over. Affirmative, we're Oscar Mike to the drop zone, out. A big ugly flashlight. She drops a big ugly flashlight. Why did she drop this? It's a laser designator, meathead. You use it to guide in airstrikes. This is a crap mission. Heads up, hostile tank. Apollo, use that laser designator. Let's see what kind of air support we've got. Holy mother of a cow! Now I feel a itsy bitsy stupid for calling it a big ugly flashlight. Regroup! Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Looks like you've stirred up a hornet's nest. We're seeing a whole lot of activity around the palace. Over. We're not exactly equipped for all out war here. Over. There's a supply station close to your current location. I'm uploading the coordinates. Get over there and stock up. Over. Affirmative. Out. You heard her. Let's go shop. Get back! 
Cara! We've got rams coming! Did you see that shot? Shit! RPG! anything useful. We're moving on to the palace ASAP. I drive one of these? Oh, I promise I won't scratch on the fire shirt and cover. I need you on those guns, Haggard. Marlo, you're the designated driver. Think you can handle that?
junkyard! by foot.
I think it's the president. What's he saying? Maybe I'm wrong, but it, it, it sounds like he's asking for help. What kind of help? I don't know. I, I think he's locked himself inside the safe room, and he can't get out. We'll get him out of there. Let's find him. Come on. Wow! This is an actual palace. It's like, a uh, um, Versailles? No. Buckingham Palace? No! Disneyland? What's it called? Xanadu. Ah, oh, crap. Those are mercs.
is open! Uh, he thinks we're not being nice. Something about an enema, I think. Uh, and he doesn't want to come. Oh, he done pissed me off. What you? Uh, somebody translate this for me. What you really want isn't the question here. Yeah, I, I got it. Uh, Presidentia. Um, yeah, Excellentia. Let me try. Your Excellency, Mr. Uh, Presidentsko. Haggard, no, you don't, you don't speak, sir. To shut up. Yeah, yeah. I am in no need of witless translation. My English is wholly immaculate, Macron. Well, then you'll have no problem understanding this. We have come to bring you in. Bring you in. Just you. Just us. <laughs> Four puny military. Four puny military. Damn it, Haggard. Four puny military is no invasion. He's trespassing. Mike One Juliet, this is Bravo One Charlie. We have the package. Repeat, we have the package. Request immediate extraction. Over. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Leave the package. Repeat, leave the package. And you're not going to like this, Sergeant, but extraction is denied. Over. Denied? What do we have to do to get the bird here? Over. I hate to tell you this, boys, but it's not going to happen. We're going for deniability. You're on your own. Over. What do you mean we're on our own? How do we get out? Over? Any way you can. This isn't my call, boys. There's nothing I can do. They're telling me to cut you loose. I'm sorry. Out. So it's like that, then. Fellas, they're leaving us hanging out to dry. Ah, shit. Now we're never getting out of here. I may have means for our escape. Our escape? I'm afraid the father of Sedarishtan people now has no other recourse than exile. It was a mistake to request the services of these mercenaries. Hang on a minute. The legionnaire is holding you here? Well, since I could not deliver the amount of gold he requested, he has appropriated my nation. But I will prevail. The Sedarishtan people will rise up and demand the return of their beloved father. Um, this guy's funny when he's in a hallucinogenic rage. And what's more, he may come in handy. Yeah, right, like tits on a bull. Well, just sit up already and tell us how to get out of here. Now, this is stately transportation for VIP. Quite improper for your unhygienic smelly bum bums. But what about the unhygienic decor? I mean, is that a mirror ball? Although I have to confess, a hot tub is a very nice touch. Now, let me see how you fly this. Hold on. Get out of that seat. No fun. Preston, show us your stuff. Preston, you the man. I'll give it a shot. So there we were, crammed in a pimped out Russian hind with a megalomaniac and a rack full of bad CDs. Left to die by our superiors, and with the world's deadliest army using us for target practice. It wasn't the first time I'd flown a chopper, but the circumstances were sort of special. The helicopter, she's crippled like a wingless swan. Oh, as a boy, I had a swan. Masha was her name. Oh, God, shut up, El Presidente! Hey, that felt pretty good. Share up the two of you. Preston, we need to set the bird down and repair it. I can't believe Miss July hung up on us like that. It wasn't her fault. The army sold us out. I should have learned not to trust them by now. Why would they do that? Just leave us. Well, things probably got out of hand. And we are bad company, remember? Expendable assets. Power tube to fix this chopper.
the job, Marlo. Let's see if this flying disco ball can do anything. Take out those trucks over there. Stay below the beautiful Sinariston hilltop so the Patriotic Air Defense will surely shoot us down! If you want to try the gunner seat, let me know. I'll put it in hover. This is it. Multiple targets up ahead. Marlo, just keep us up in the air. And stay clear of incoming fire. Incoming RPG! Burn like squirrels! Let's shake things up a little. See those fuel silos up ahead? That's right! Yeah, you got to do Heads up, Marlo. I've got a visual on some mobile AA. Target destroyed! One more to go! One. That should keep them busy. There's the local garrison. Hit it.
We'll keep an eye on his excellency. out of his excellency here. Like they're moving their supplies. Let's hit them.
is what you should be looking for. Sweets and I'll stay and defend the chopper. And also protect VIP. You're only alive as long as we can use you. Very harsh. But fair.
Incoming RPG! Okay, guys, get the bird refueled and let's get her up in the air. I'll do it. I'll do it, Sarge. We'll be out of here in no time. Well, don't get me wrong. I want to get out of here, too, but where are we going exactly? Not to worry. Around next bend is beautiful Polio Lower National Bridge. He's named for my mother. A bridge? A bridge to where? Oh, to Russia. To Russia? We don't want to go to Russia. I am devastated to inform you that there is no alternative unless we want to stay in the vicinity of my once loyal crew. Speaking of this... Oh, shit! Here they come! Hang it! You thought? Oh, no. What the hell was that? What did you do to the chopper, Haggard? What? It wasn't me! Honest! I was filling it up and it just blew! You put the gas in there? That's the cooling unit! Oh! Well, excuse me for not reading gobbledygook! Shut up, you two! Sweetwater, get this sorted! We're gonna hold this ground! Anything happens to the chopper, we're dead! Get to it! Still not working. Watch out for those more hostiles incoming! Just a few more seconds! A few more seconds! We don't have a few more seconds! Do you really think you're the right person to nag at this point? What your army could manage? Well, it's true the Shadarashtan army is cowardly and badly trained, but over the years I have tried to compensate this with an excess of advanced hardware, as you can see! Oh, God damn it, that's hostile armor! Sweetwater, you better quit dicking around! But Sarge, I haven't had time to reset the- I don't care! Let's go! Now! But if it's not working, then it's not- It's working! <laughs> it's working! Mano, back to the chopper! Getting off. For an exile, it is quite inadequate. I'm in need of further transportation. Well, where we're going, you can't come. Yeah? But where exactly are we going? You've got a short memory, Sweetwater. I know. The gold. You're talking about the gold, but we don't know where they took it. With all the mercs around here, I bet we can find out. You are talking about the gold of Treacherous Legionnaire. <laughs> I know where it is. Do you know where it is? Yes, yes, of course. And I am sure we can come to some agreement. Oh, yeah. You hear that, sweet? Yeah. But I'd like to come to some agreement about the black chopper coming up behind us. What? Shit! 
There has to be better ways to start a new career. But you know what they say about hitting the bottom. It really, really hurts. Mike 1 Juliet, this is Bravo 1 Charlie. Over. Mike 1 Juliet, this is Bravo 1 Charlie. Everyone's gone. I think they've been taken. I don't know what to do. Please advise, over. Is anyone there? Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike with Juliet, over. You're back. Can you help me out, over? Officially, we're denying all knowledge about your trip to Sadaristan. As far as command is concerned, you're AWOL as well as dead. But I just can't quit on my boys, over. You don't know how glad I am to hear that. Do you have a location fix on me? Over? Looks like Russia to me. Over. I think my squad's been taken prisoner. Can you send someone to help me out? Over? Negative. This is strictly extracurricular. Listen, I can see you on the satellite, and I'll try to help. But you can't contact me. Understand? Over. I got you. Over. I'm picking up radio signals from a village near your position. Some kind of military installation. I think you should look for your boys there. Out. Thank you, Miss July. Sure. 
Придется отходить. Брат, Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Looks like the location has been vacated. I'm picking up one heat source now, but that's probably you. If they were there before, they must have moved them. Listen, I've managed to find out a couple of things about the area you're in. There's some kind of communications hub deeper in the valley. Get over there and see if you can find some information. Out. Thank <laughs> you. 
Машина едет! Mike one Juliet, there's a lot of activity up at the monastery. Something's up. You better hurry. Out. 
Вот тебе! Charlie, this is Mike Juan Juliet. I gotta keep this brief. From Intel, I managed to scrounge an old outline of the monastery. Not a lot of detail, but it looks like there may be a hidden entrance to the eastern wall. Take a look, but stay low. Out. Preston, great to see you, buddy. Now we thought you were dead for sure. What are you doing here? Uh, looking for you. So, you came to rescue us. That's great, man. I mean, well, not really necessary, but thanks anyway. Yeah, you're welcome. Glad to have you back, Marlo. But we need to get out of here before the enemy regroup. Yeah, we gotta try and find this uh, Sirdar fella, because he knows where the gold is. Have you seen him? Do you know where he is? Not really, no. But Haggard figures if we just stumble around the monastery for a while thinking happy thoughts, maybe we'll run into him. I mean, that is the plan, right, Haggard? I wouldn't have put it exactly like that, but yep, pretty much. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. Are you still with me, Marlo? Any luck finding the others? Over. Oh, he's had a little bit of luck. Over. 
We're all here. How you doing yourself? I swear, you are from SweetVoices.com. I know it. <laughs> Sorry, Haggard, but you don't rank high enough to pick me up a cup of coffee. Yeah, she told you, Haggard. But since you asked, I am fine, thank you. And I'm very glad to hear you're all back together. Over. We're trying to locate Sirdar. You got an idea where they might be holding him? Over. I don't know, but there's a lot of activity down by the river mouth. Maybe you should check there. Over. Okay, Mike Juliet. Juliet. Stay in touch. Over. out of here and find them. Commandos at the gate. Let's roll. Ah, crap.
Damn it! The helicopter's here. We've got to get to the coast. Some more of those left. Are they following us? They are following us. Go, go, go. What the? He's down. Yeah, you such a good boy. Take a left, Marlo. Marlo's across that No train. more road here. Change of plan. I see boats. Let's steal a boat or something to reach the coast. Ditch the ride and keep a low profile. Hey, that's the same chopper that brought us down at the border. Yeah, and I have a pretty good idea who it belongs to. Look, it's the president. It seems your American friends have escaped. They won't get far. Those imperialist pigs are not my friends. You tried to escape from your debts, and they helped you. It was no escape, but an abduction. Most vile. I realize now that I will never get the gold you owe me. I will forget about your debt and take your country instead. <laughs> Absolutely. Not a problem. I will go into exile, live a quiet life. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Kill him. I will not beg for my life. Something smarty pants? Ah, uh, both you motor mouths. Shut up. Just follow me. Ah! It's a miracle. I'm not dead. Hello, your highness. Remember us, Pookums? Yes, yes. Imperialist pigs. Uh, very nice. Just shut up already. Let's take that boat. Hey, guys, look. There it is. Yeah. I told you we'd see that boat again. It's a legionnaire, all right. Well, at least we're in the right place. So, how are we gonna do this? We're gonna have to take the long way around. Let's start by securing the beach. I kinda like this place. 
Looks like somewhere I could go for a vacation. Sure, if you don't mind the snipers, or the mines on the beach, or the smell of death. Actually, guys, if memory serves, they were about to build a big resort thing here before the war started, and uh, you don't really care, do you? Listen, if we ever had a shot at the gold, this is it. Let's find a vehicle and go around to the coast in Sadiz. We'll try to get as close as possible to that ship, and then... And then we'll what? Then we'll improvise. Okay, guys, uh, am I the only one starting to get cold feet about this? Yep. Embrace the suck, sweets. Embrace the suck.
Forever one, Charlie. This is Mike one, Juliet. Did you boys take a wrong turn? You're in Cadiz. Over? No. We're KIA, remember? What we're doing is nobody's business anymore. Over. I guess you're right. But you're making it awfully hard for me to help you. And Cadiz is a hornet's nest. Over. Sarge, tell her. You remember when I hung up on you back in Sadaristan? We were on the track of some gold. The Legionnaire's gold, if that means anything to you. Over. I've heard the stories. Over. We've got some pretty good intel saying it's here. We're going to try to grab it. Over. Things being what they are, I can't really blame you. But be advised, U.S. forces are moving into the area. Looks like it might be quite a brawl, so watch out for friendly fire. Over. <laughs> I don't even know which fire is friendly anymore. Over. And hey, don't you boys forget me if you hit the mother load. Out. Just tell me your favorite color, baby!
They're pounding the snot out of us with 155s. Someone clobber those guns, for Christ's sake. Uh-oh. Hear that? Yeah. Mech. Sounds like our guys are taking a hell of a hammer. This isn't our war anymore. I don't care about the war, but those are still our guys getting blown to pieces over there. Yeah, yeah. Looks like it's still working. Maybe we could use it. Watch your back!
Armor tanks closing in. This is gonna hurt. Time to move. Give me some marshmallows. Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. You're about to get some company. Over. Hostiles? Over. No. We're launching a counter-offensive, and the first wave will reach your position in a couple of minutes. We're gonna secure the bridges to the south, and then we should be able to take the rest of town pretty easily. Watch out for friendly fire. Out. Shit. The U.S. assault is coming this way. If they catch up with us, we're never gonna be able to get that gold. She said something about bridges, right? If we blow those, maybe you can hold them long enough to get to the ship. You want to stop the U.S. advance? Wouldn't that be, like, treason? I'm not saying stop it. I'm saying hold it off for a while. Not the same thing. Oh, I think it'd be enough to get us executed. As far as the Army's concerned, we're already dead, remember? And Hager's right. We gotta blow those bridges. guys let's take out those bridges before they get here
You know what a movie? This is about the time the bad guy showed up. Or maybe the best friend of the bad guy. Yeah, the question is just which bad guy? Where are you? Over here! Put over here! That's a hunter! Well, someone sure opened a can of whoop-ass on this place. Coming up on sardines. Get ready. Nice. But it won't buy me that truck of yours. Mercenaries. Great. So now we're fighting the mechs, the mercenaries, our own boys. Hey, wouldn't it be great if the Russians showed up too? We're not gonna get past. We've gotta create some kind of diversion. Hagger, you up for it? Can I bring Preston? Yeah, the two of you draw their attention and Sweets and me will see if we can find that goal. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. If you can hear me, there's an army recon supply drop close to your position. I'm sending you the coordinates. Guess someone appreciated your help after all. Good luck, boys. Out. Chief Press, it's karma. Let's see what they dropped us. Sounds good to me. Come on, friends. Let's check it out.
Oh, nice. Another laser designator. Call in a strike on that big old fuel silo over there. That should shake things up a little. This is 07 at 12 miles now, bearing 270 Angel Street. Then by for bomb drop. I think it works. Let's see if they come this way. It's working. Armor and hostiles moving your way now. Try to catch up and we'll see you down by the harbor. Shit! Get him off me! Get started. We saw a car on the way over here that you could probably use. 
I'm sending you the coordinates. Oh, that sucks! No troops! I bet we're gonna have to keep shooting at each other then. Fine! All right. Fine by me. Bravo One Charlie, this is Mike One Juliet. You're in the kill box. We're about to drop some heavy rain on your position. Get out of there now. Out. No problem. I'm an excellent driver. Wasn't a spook story. Oh no! Look at it! Yeah, please! It's true. It's true. Tons of gold. <laughs> My thoughts exactly. But I'll be damned. I really didn't want to ruin the moment, but we had no idea how we were going to get the gold out of there. And the bad guy was still, you know. Alive and kicking. Come on! We need to get out of here! No shit! You want me to make a plan for you? Maybe I do! We need a bigger gun! I think I know where to find one! Follow me, but fast!
I think we lost them. You think? Was that your idea of a plan? I'll just sip it, you two. Now it's payback time. You sound tense, Sarge. You sleeping all right? I don't know, Haggard. I'm really impressed with the Sarge's mastered use of the leadership cliché. Ah, uh, just shut up, fools. Here it comes. It's coming around again. starting to pull your weight in this squad. Heck yeah, you can watch my back any day. Yeah, not bad for a new guy. Well, guys... Hey, let's just get back to the gold. It's been great to finally become a part of... Hey, guys, anyone actually thought about how we're gonna get the gold out of here? There you go again. Negative, negative, negative. Well, you got any idea how heavy it's gonna be? We're gonna be the richest GIs in the world. Can't you just 
Smell the coffee and be happy about that? Shut it, Haggard. I guess it was too good to be true. Look what your negative thoughts brung us. Oh, so this is all my fault? It doesn't matter. We blew it. Let's just get out of here before they spot us. Soldiers! What are you waiting for? Sir, uh, uh, we're a group of highly, uh, embedded, uh... Sir, the area is secure. Just waiting for new orders, sir. Take that truck and follow the convoy. Uh, uh, that truck, sir? Yeah, that truck full of, uh, scrap metal. Move out! Sir, sir yes, sir. sir! Wars are fought for any number of reasons. Sometimes, if the ones they give you aren't good enough, you have to find your own. And, maybe, if you're lucky, you get out in one piece. But in the end, I guess it's really about the guys next to you. Truckosaurus Rex, here I come! Grad school, here I come! Woohoo! Let's go fishing! Ah!